Interesting how every time she expressed sympathy, the customer explained more, gave her a little bit more. Now, in the back here, you might be thinking, why would we want to do that? Do you think this lady at the end cares about the fee? It's not about logic. It's not about your fee. It's not about when you can come out. It's about connecting with the customer on an emotional level. If we can connect with the customer on an emotional level, guess what? Now that stuff matters. It's not about logic. People don't buy logically. They buy emotionally. So our goal is to connect with them on an emotional level. One of the reasons we wanted to bring Brigham and his team in was really to focus on something that often gets overlooked at the contractor level, unfortunately, which is customer service and having a process and having a system in place to provide great customer service from the first phone call all the way through the experience with the customer. I really like how it kind of went in sequence of plan A, B, and C because I have a problem jumping around um, and he's, you know, he's got a solution to any obstacle that we have, he'll tell you how to get over it. The interactions really, that really helped because he would sit in on it individually and help you because, you know, if, if I'm talking to a peer, they may not know it's okay that you got that out of order, or it's not okay that you got that out of order, and he was really hands-on with that. I think it's gonna be a game changer. Today was key in bringing together some scripts that would be very beneficial for our contractors, even distributors, to help close sales and bring in more business. They really had an outline of how you should talk to your customers, talk about situations that could be volatile, and how to diffuse those and upsell at the same time. The environment of the class was great. They didn't put people on the spot or make them feel uncomfortable, yet they engaged the whole room. They had abundance of energy and vibrance in their presentations. Uh, they were awesome. Hey, I just need a price of a three-ton system. Okay, well, tell me more. Is your system currently working? What do you guys charge for a pound of a refrigerant? Well, tell me more. Why do you think you need refrigerant? Is that different? from every other company that's just given a price? I think a lot of contractors do have a basic idea. They understand the importance of customer service. The question is, are they actually going to go after it? Are they actually going to take advantage of the fact that there's information out there and really come up with a solid plan that they can implement in their company and create a, a true culture? The customer needs to know that you've listened to them, you have empathy for their problem, you have an understanding, you're here to help. And that carries through when the technician is on hand, if they're carrying through that customer service level, then it's an overall great experience from beginning to end, and that's what's gonna bring you back repeat business.